Hello friends, in this video we are going to deal with most common error of Android development which one is attempt to invoke virtual method in Android. We are going to perform this practical inside Android Studio 4.1. Final output we are going to fix this error which is look like this one java.lang.nullpointer exception or attempt to invoke virtual method with the null object reference. Most commonly, this error can be happen with the beginner level of the development in Android. It can be happen with the text view, it can be happen with the button or edit text. As per the Android guideline, upgrade your Android Studio to latest one. Currently, it is 4.1. So, check for the update, go to help and let's start. How to fix error? Attempt to invoke virtual method in Android. So, go to Android Studio and new project with empty activity and deal with text view. First, we are going to design the screen with text view and we try to generate that error and try to resolve that error. So, it is most common when we set text programmatically. So, go to file new and new project with empty activity. Click on next. Give the name, whatever the name you want to give. Likewise, demo underscore error underscore virtual method and click on finish. All the stuffs are ready. Mind well that many times text view is inbuilt with basic design of this template. See this one. Here you can see the text view. Just uh, we want to do certain attributes to set. Likewise, first give the ID at the plus ID and my text view. I want to give the name for this one. And uh, there is text is hello world is inbuilt with this one. Just I set text size, which one is 30 SP and uh, text color will be black as 0, 0, 0. RGB is the color value of this one. But mind well, my text view is the ID of our text view. So mostly what we do, go to the main activity dot Java and define text view, my text view and just we are going to deal with the set text. Likewise, my text view dot set text and set the text whatever the text you want to set. Likewise, I set these texts getting error. Okay, so simply we just set the text, define the text view on the top side and run the app mind well log cat. Locket is the friend of developer. So, this one is AVD. I am preparing with my AVD uh, and let's see what happens. Our activity is about to launch and mind well the concentration, concentration on locket. So, see this one and over here you can see this one is java.lang.runtime exception and attempt to invoke virtual method while on null object reference. Most commonly, uh, we need to say that we have to habituate with locket. So, where to see and mostly commonly you have to approach for the beginner level task of red block. So, just set my text view and invoke with uh, round brackets. If it is text view, then you need to write text view. Give the find view by id. Likewise, r dot id dot my text view. Simply one step is missing. So most commonly type it is one step is missing. Just I correct it. This is this text not getting error. So very easily we can say this one that uh, there is no more error. Just one step is missing. So this text not getting error. So easily we can deal with the text view and what is the point or where is we can say that this is the scope of generating the error. So just we deal with the button right now just we remove the text view and uh, go to activity underscore main dot xml and just we replace the text view with button. So this is the second example because text view and button is most common UI component. So, just I write my button and text will be just I say this one is click. Also, I want to 
set width a will become match parent and just I set padding over here of 10 dp. So everything is okay with design level. So if you we are going to click on this button. So just I type on main activity button my button and mostly we what we do we set set on click listener my button dot set on click listener click listener new space and control space. So view on click listener is there. So when we try to run this app press shift F10 and let's see what happens with this uh, newly taken button on the screen. So just we set the button and set the on click listener. The same thing happens many times with the Android development development. Likewise, we miss again the same error attempt to invoke virtual method with the button also on null object reference. So it is most common thing. So just you miss one line, which one is find view by ID. So just I give my button equals to typecast with whatever the component you have taken likewise button then type button over here and give the find view by id r dot id dot my button simple so press semicolon and uh, if someone is clicking on the button just i set tossed message toss dot mac text get application context whatever the name you want to give likewise easy click we can say that and uh, press toast dot what are the length short or long but always remember dot show will be there so press semicolon and let's see uh, press shift f10 there is no more error of this one so let's see and click on this one okay post message is there just one line is missing it is my button find you by id r dot id dot whatever the component id you have given so final output how to fix attempt to invoke virtual method in Android we have resolved by easy way. It is one of the best thing whereas I try to resolve this one. There are many way of resolving this one but most common way I have tried to cover in this video. Uh, better way to approach with view binding or data binding in latest concept of Android development in to don't give the find view by ID or necessary for the find view by ID. It is also solution of fatal exception with the package name and PID whatever the PID is given current date is 22035. For more updates regarding Android subscribe this channel and share it. So how to fix the error? It is just an experiment I want to share with you. The video tutorial is about to complete. So thanks for watching. Keep coding, keep learning and feel free to contact, like it and subscribe it. Thank you. Thank you very much.